Well, she used a tragedy to steal from hundreds in the community, but she won't spend another day behind bars. Matt Hansen explains why. It's been one year since a boating accident rocked the small fishing community of Baudet. But only tonight can they finally begin to heal. And it made a lot of people angry. Um, be because the, the boys were, were loved by everybody. Bonnie Janicki proudly displays pictures of her former co-workers at Sportsman's Lodge. Cody Ostendorf, Justin Ogvit, and Keith Ayers all drowned when their boat overturned on Lake of the Woods in the middle of the night. It was difficult for especially the people that work in the lake community. Following the tragedy, 29-year-old Rotina Lavala helped in the search for the bodies and launched a GoFundMe page to help the families with funeral expenses. Nearly 400 people contributed $27,000. We'll call State of Minnesota versus Rotina Rayon Lavala. However, $6,000 didn't make it to the families, but instead went into Lavala's own pocketbook to pay bills and for groceries. It's destroyed a lot of trust that a lot of people have now. Today, Lavala was sentenced after pleading guilty to theft. The mother of Keith Ayers sent a letter for the county prosecutor to read aloud. To prey upon the vulnerability of our families and community is an action of a predator. I do not believe that any apology would be of truth. It would be only words to excuse her behavior with hope to lessen the punishment of her actions. When Lavala was asked if she wanted to address the court, she uttered just three words. According to the plea agreement, Lavala will not go back to jail. She was given credit for time served, which was about two months. Her lawyer told me she avoided bonding out after her initial arrest in an effort to avoid the community. With the case now closed, the community of 1,100 can finally try to move on from the drowning deaths of three well-loved men. We can kind of move forward. Everybody's laid to rest. Um, and she had to admit what she had done. Lavala will be on probation for five years and has to write a letter of apology to all three families. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.